we keep hearing about how there's this great possibility of another attack. Like, and, and when we think about it, if there's another attack, it's, it, it's not something that should be considered another attack. It should be considered the second wave. I find it interesting that there were no gunshots out of the insurrection, out of the peaceful crowd that mauled its way into the Capitol building on a specific day with a specific line of reasoning. No gunshot. There were no guns coming from this side. And you say, see, we were peaceful. And all that says to me that can see things like any of us should, sometimes it takes an idea to be shared, but it, can't you see it? Who knows what was going on behind the lines? What kind of messages were going around? For whatever reason, these guys that were coming in and, and get them boys. Those guys, they were already told not to fire upon people. This was a first wave. This was something that if it would have worked, the word now would have been, look at what pussies they are. Do you think you can trust your neighbor anymore? They won't even stand up for you. Something like that. They could say something like that. And, and but I don't think they expected it to work 100%, close to 100%. I think it was just a bluff, a gimmick, a ruse just to get everybody moving. And then everybody, ah, and they said, don't shoot him. Don't shoot him. They were hoping that the police, this minimal force that they had, was just going to say, oh, fuck this. Pop, 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 pop. And then they were going to be able to use that. Amazingly enough, I'm probably glad I wasn't in that crowd. I, like anything else, I would have made everybody around me look bad. I try to dress well in court, but, you know, other than that, you get what you get. I would have made people look bad if I were one of those guys up there. I probably would have started pop, 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 pop. Give me, reload. You know, pop, 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 pop. I'll trade you. You're not using it. Pop, 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 pop. And uh, who knows? Who knows? That's why I never became a cop. It'd just be too much fun. So then they talk about come August, he's coming back in again. That poor guy. He's on a wing and a prayer. He's like the greatest American hero, William Cat, man. Believe it or not, I'm walking on protesters. I never thought I would be so tall. My hair is gray and my skin is orange. My hands don't fit around my penis at all. Who could it be? Believe it or not, it's just me. Oh, I always thought that meant I had a big dick. Oh, it's just like it. I, I, I don't mean to make fun of anybody's small hands. It's just funny that it's taken them so long to, to say anything about them again. They're more interested in other shit, I suppose. They used to talk about his small hands all the time. You know, I mean, that's what it is to be a man, right? I mean, look at that Violent Femmes song with that woman, supposedly, and he's saying, big hands, I know you're the one. Let me go wild. Mm. I got blister on my dick. So, 
they're talking about the, the concern about August comes and um, no, it's not going to be good because there's nothing anywhere short of a damn full-blown military coup where you can't even trust your neighbors when you get home from your weekend at the Capitol. You're like, I did a great job. Fucking neighbors going, you were saying your 401k was better than it had ever been? Well, you just fucked everything up for me. Gah, right in the fucking back. Won't be a long civil war because nobody will expect the Democrats to be that pissed off, but I guess they've had enough by now. So we're worried about these people rolling out. They're already make, buying more guns and making more bombs and stuff like that. Yeah. I have a solution. I have a solution. You take all these damn Christians and everybody else, whoever they are that comes in every six months or so and says, rapture's coming. I mean, fuck. It was supposed to be either the 14th or 15th of June, according to that Moto X addict that fucking sends me shit that I know doesn't watch my show. He's just, he's got some form letter that the number of bombs change every week. And you take him and all these other people, and hell, some of them are probably already there. The people that believe that the rapture is coming, but ah, according to him, I was supposed to be 14th or the 15th, maybe the 22nd, if not on the 14th or the 15th, and for sure by the end of June, but if not then by the end of the year. Um, send them down to talk to these people. There have been raptures going on for so long. The end of the world's been here. I can count them. I could. I've never put any thought into it. That is seventh grade, this, that, 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 that. They keep telling us, that, you know, 2012, that's just the end of the world as we know it. Um, uh, uh, you know, all this stuff. The Jim Jones and those people with the Nike shoes and everybody that's that's killing themselves because the rapture's coming and it, well those that really believe and the rest of them are like I, I i don't know you told me that i shouldn't drink it makes an ass out of me and they put it down and they go home and they uh, you know set up the funeral and they're like next time next time there's nothing that says you need to be personally involved for this shit to happen Send all these people down to talk to the people and tell them, hey, look, you know, I know it was supposed to happen March 14th or wherever the hell it was, and I know it was supposed to happen before that, and I know it's supposed to have happened in August, but it it's not going to, and it didn't. Um, what you have to know is that if you're going to be a true believer, you don't ask your Lord to give you everything right now. Be patient. Be patient. Outside of a mental clinic, be patient. You still go do your job and you'll still be surprised to find that after, if, if you live a hundred years, you're probably not going to see any of this stuff, but it's coming. Just be patient. And, um, That's what you do. Take the people that keep missing their rapture, those that, that know, well, I missed it this time. I must have been in the wrong place. Something must have been off. You know, they talk about the years, the, the whole factoring in of time and how it just, well, maybe it wasn't today. Maybe, maybe some really smart guy didn't have good enough math to tell us when it was going to happen back then and uh too bad that guy's not here when we get a time machine we'll go back and we'll bring him up here and we'll teach him our math and he'll get it right and then we can have our rapture then we can have our civil war a fence line civil war just come to understand just because somebody says something it 
doesn't mean it's true. And come to understand, your life is better right now, or let's say uh, eight months ago, nine months ago. It was better than it will ever be again if you can't learn to be patient.